since I didn't end Vlogmas properly, I'll do the intro one last time. <laughs> What's up everybody, it's your girl Stress Nicole here and I know, I know, I fell off with Vlogmas. I couldn't build up the energy to just edit. It was the editing that was the issue, mostly. I am gonna throw in one moment of unreleased vlog footage for the purpose of this video, which is me closing out Vlogmas with a Christmas haul video. Now, I don't know if people still do these, but I figured I might as well do one to end out Vlogmas because yeah, I just don't want to end on some random day. So I just want to do one last Christmassy thing and I want to share the gifts that I got for Christmas with you all. First, I want to go with the gifts that I got on New Year's Eve. Now, New Year's Eve, I get the same. I mean, it's pretty much clockwork now, but um, I get a set of PJs, which is this lovely ensemble that you're seeing right now. I got these flannel PJs. Me, my mom, and my sister have the same pair of PJs. And so I got that on Christmas Eve, as well as the first gift from my sister, which is a Lush bath bomb set. It came wrapped looking like a present. I already used some of it, so I'm gonna put pictures here of what um, actually should be in here. I got a polar bear plunge bubble bath bar. Oh, a polar bear plunge bubble bar. I got that. Also, um, the Golden Wonder, which is my favorite bath bomb from Lush. It only comes out, obviously, around Christmas time, and so I use that on Christmas Day. Here's what's left of the box is <laughs> some of the polar bear RIP, but um, yeah, I have a little bit of the bubble bar left. And the last intact thing that I have is a Jingle Ball bath bomb. Ooh, ASMR. Can't wait to mess up the bathtub with this. I don't know what colors are inside. I never had this bath bomb before, but pretty sure it's gonna be great. All right, now Christmas day. So I also included two things that I got for myself <laughs> on Christmas and like the day after Christmas with like stuff that I got Christmas day. So I'm gonna start with the items that Santa brought me first. I have these, I think they're either called acid wash or black tie-dye sweats from the Try Guys, gonna rock these a lot, so. Cause I only have like one pair of sweatpants, which is sad. I got myself a puzzle. It was in like the little boops and bops and tchotchkes like area of Target, like from the beginning where it's like the random like $3, $5 items. So I got a macaron puzzle and I might just be that dork and like mod podge it or like, what is it like? It, glue it together and hang it because like this is a vibe these colors would like really pop well in my room and also this was my plan but it didn't go well i got myself a unicorn box i was helping out my family i said if you have a gift for me put it in this box so i can open the box christmas day and be like Ooh, yay, unicorn box but um no one took me over my offer so i just now have a random Unicorn box, <laughs> that's Christmas. <laughs> so, whatever. Speaking of unicorns, I'm gonna move on to the gifts that my family got me. I think this is an awesome gift, so come at me. But <laughs> my sister got me a light up unicorn, like a LED light unicorn. It's like made for nurseries for like babies. <laughs> But I don't care. I'm going to light this thing up. It's going to be a whole vibe. I can't wait to add it to the unicorn family. Some more items that I got from my sister are Fenty Beauty lip glosses. I know Riri hasn't been in the studio, but the girl can make some good gloss. <laughs> and also my favorite setting spray, the Urban Decay setting spray. I got two bottles. Ooh, fancy. Since this is the last non-clothing item, or is it? I'm just gonna show this, even though it was a stocking stuffer, not really a gift, but I'm gonna talk about this and then move on to the clothes that I got. But I got a Trader Joe's gift card. I'm about to buy all those sparkling apple juices and sweet potato chips. Ugh, I can't wait. <laughs> Next 
If you know me, you know I love a graphic tee. I have been eyeing this graphic tee for the longest. My sister has one. I wish Clarissa would explain it all. Now, love Clarissa Explains It All. Great show. Also, Clarissa, Sharissa, I need, <laughs> I needed this shirt in my life, clearly. And apparently she had a theme going because my next shirt is a Nickelodeon shirt. And then, <laughs> Her words, and I quote, you never wear green, so I'm making you wear green. I mean, true, I don't wear green, who knows? Maybe green's my color. And then lastly, I got a Black Panther shirt. I love the shirt, I love Black Panther, it's just oh, dear to my heart. All right, so the last item I got from my sister was a jean jacket. I've been wanting a jean jacket for a while now. So I finally got one. Can't wait to wear it. I don't know when I'll wear it because you know, outside is like a dangerous place. <laughs> All right, so next I got this. What is it called? I think it's a, I forgot the name, but basically it's like a lounger thing, like a, a very oversized hoodie and it's Mickey Mouse is on it. My parents got that for me. Kind of pulled at the heartstrings because I was supposed to go to Disneyland at least twice this year. <laughs> and I didn't get to go. <laughs> but for now, this will keep me warm until I can go to the parks again. Next up, I got a hat. I just needed a solid black hat because I keep stealing my dad's Adidas hat. I have snapbacks from like ages 20 to 22. I wore snapbacks a lot, but I didn't have a plain black like dad hat. Can't put it on my head right now because I got a bun. Oh! <laughs> my friend, well, I texted her yesterday and she told me about it. So I don't know if her ruin is surprise or not, but my friend, Lerlyn, she got me something. I'm curious, I have an idea of what it is. <gasps> I was right. I'm gonna read the card first. <sighs> May the hope of Christmas remain in your heart throughout the year. I hope next year brings you success and happiness. Love you and miss you. I miss you too so much. Love, Lerlyn. Oh, so if you guys don't know, my friend Lerlyn, she is, I think, I think she's my first friend like ever. But yeah, she lives in New York now, so I don't get to see her as much, but it's okay. When the world is safe again, I'm going to New York. We're seeing a show on Broadway, preferably six. And <laughs> we're just gonna have the best time ever. She made me a painting! Hold, hold, hold on. Is it reversible? just me in a nutshell like purple used to be my favorite color and then now it's like tealy light blue and so like this is just the evolution of Sharissa and the beanie and of course I always wear black <laughs> best of both worlds Hannah Montana beanie I'm so excited and I don't feel like moving to show it to you, but I got a Roku. My sister didn't need her Roku anymore because she got a new TV and it has Roku on it. So now she bestowed the Roku upon me and oh my gosh, that thing is incredible. Now I get to watch YouTube, Hulu, Disney Plus, like all of the things on my TV. Then last, but certainly not least, the gift that shocked me. <laughs> I was not expecting this at all, but my parents came through. I got the iPhone 12. <laughs> Rewind, backstory. Okay, so I didn't ask for the iPhone 12 because I was planning on buying one probably around like, I don't know, like March. Save up some money, save up my little coins. You think I would ask for this in this economy? In the middle of a pandemic? In the middle of a pantomime? <laughs> yes, I left this off my list because I was gonna buy one for myself. <laughs> but they decided to do a little gag gift on me and put it in old wrapping and like old, in an old like Amazon bag and just like random things. I wasn't expecting it. <laughs> they got me the phone and the case and it's 
like a whole new world. <laughs> And see, this is why I'm not a fan of constantly updating my phones. Like, when a new one comes out, obviously I don't get it. I was on the iPhone 7. And even back then, I remember I cried over that iPhone 7. Like, iPhones are expensive. And to just, to keep up with every new generation of iPhone is very expensive. You appreciate it more when you go longer without, like, updating it. For example, portrait mode. I didn't know what that was. <laughs> the way I would have to do portrait mode before is just smudge my lens a little bit to get it kind of foggy. Like, I could... Face ID, what's that? I didn't get the jokes. <laughs> but yesterday, I had my first encounter of not being able to unlock my phone because my face mask was on. I'm like, oh my god, I get it. And just overall, the, the quality of the speaker, the quality of the camera, it's bigger like I feel like I have to hold my phone like this because I'm just not used to that wide of a phone and the screen god the screen the screen is so big it spans across the whole phone there's no border it's just I'm amazed yes I do miss my home button that's the one thing that kept me hanging on to that seven for so long and also you know I have the not stove top um aliens from chicken little looking um camera on the back I just have the two dots not the three so um yeah because the three one that one just creeps me out I'm gonna wait for like the iPhone 17 when they finally get the technology together to put everything in one lens <laughs> but yeah that's what I got for Christmas this year I hope you enjoyed your Christmas was by yourself with your family hopefully you got to connect with them at some point during the day happy kwanzaa to people celebrating kwanzaa but yeah i'm grateful that i was able to spend it with my family we were able to exchange gifts with each other sorry that i wasn't able to vlog it it was just i woke up and then five blinks later i was at the christmas tree unwrapping gifts it was just all a blur <laughs> that's why vlogmas ended abruptly and why there is no christmas special hopefully this video suffice I, I don't know and also i just want to reiterate that in no way is this video being made to be like oh look what i got it's just i know some people generally want to know what other people got for christmas it's not like a rubbing it in your face that i got a nursery lamp and you did it <laughs> But yeah, I'm planning one more video of 2020 and then after that, who knows, I might go ghost for a year like I always do. <laughs> Make sure you hit the like button and share my video and also hit the notification bell, do all the things to make sure that you know when I upload because now that Vlogmas is over, who knows when I'll upload next. <laughs> I'm Sharissa Nicole, until next time, I'm out.